So I wanted to add one point around um, how do you create sort of that rating system around you? Mm -hmm. Because uh, in um, early or mid-stage enterprises, the founder is the CEO. So whereas you might have that, you know, the founder by nature is a risk taker, is someone who is optimistic and so on and so forth. And not to say that you should not be optimistic, but if it's not in you, so self-awareness is very important. You know, if it is not in you to think about all the things that can go wrong, please recognize that, that it is not in my nature to acknowledge the things that can go wrong and think rationally about them. If it's not in your nature to do that, some people are able to do both, but if it's not in your nature to do that, find people around you who can do that for you and with you. It could be your colleague, it could be your uh, COO or Chief Operating Officer, whatever the, it could be your CFO, but someone who you respect who's a peer in the business, in your team, or someone outside. Um, I've seen situations, I personally have situations where you know, my mentor, I, I make sure there are at least a couple of people around me who are going to ask me tough questions. And in that moment, you might not like to hear it. But if you respect them and you've empowered them to ask you tough questions, it will at least act as that breaking mechanism for you. So I think it's very important to have that around you. Um, but as you scale up and then if you have the ability to get some, I think CFOs play a wonderful role in organizations where they're able to ask these tough questions and say, I'm sorry, it's my job. I'm going to ask you these difficult questions. That's a very nice thing to have on your team, to have colleagues and, and a culture that is uh, open to dissent and debate, very respectful, open to dissent and debate.